Hey all, today we are going to look at how we can fill our text with gradient. Let's start by creating a new design. Uh, for this I'll be just taking a thousand by thousand pixels because this is uh, for just example purposes, not uh, anything specific. So I'm uh, just going to load our workspace. And from here, we want to search uh, for gradient background. So go over to the element section on your left hand corner, click on it and type in gradient background or just type in gradient uh, and you will get a lot of options. Uh, we want uh, static images. So we're just going to click on static, filter it and then choose a gradient that you want to work with. Okay, so I'm going to set this as a background and then I'm going to put in a text. Uh, this will work with uh, mostly all text, but uh, if there are fancy text, maybe you might have some uh, issues along the way, but uh, it, is, it is sort of, you can sort it out. Let's try this with uh, my cartoon fun style um, text. Okay, I'm just uh, typing in summer vibes and uh, okay, I'm just uh, zooming in for you to see that okay, this is a uh, black, so I want to change the color of this. But before that, I'm going to reduce the transparency. Okay, uh, the transparency, the best transparency uh, range is between 38 to 45, depending on your text actually and uh, the gradient background. Okay, so now you can see that when I change the color to white, it is a bit more visible. So I'm going to just to adjust it a little bit more so that I can bring out the gradient uh, vibe. Okay, so now I think it is reflecting. The, the gradient is showing through the transparency of the text. Okay, uh, if you want to change the change it to others also, you can do it. But uh, you have to make sure that uh, before we save this image, you have to make all the changes to the text. Like if you want it to be in two lines or single line, everything has to be decided before we are going to download this image. Because after that, uh, it will be an it will become an image file and you won't be able to change anything. So I am happy with this. And and um, I am going to just download this. Okay, just adding in the title. Okay, and uh, I'm going to download this file. Go to the share section and then click on download. And you want to download just page one. And I want to I don't want to click transparent background because I want the background. So I'm going to download this. Once it has been downloaded, you want to upload this image back into Canva. Okay, so we'll go to your left hand corner and click on Uploads. Okay, find your file and then upload it back into Canva. Okay, once you have it, you click on another page, you add a page and then click on the image you just uploaded and then we are going to get rid of the background okay just go once you click on the image you can go to edit image click on it and go to background remover uh, remember that background remover is a pro only uh, so you have to get a pro account and if you want a free pro account or a trial version you can click on the link in the description box below so once you click on the background remover this is what you get and i am quite happy with it and um, now this is how you create a gradient text okay i will show you another example uh, a bit more vibrant color I'm going to choose and uh, I'm going to adjust it again I'm going to just fill this background and then I'm going to put in the text just going to copy and paste because the transparency and everything is already set so I'm going to adjust it again maybe this time let's play around with another font okay I'll just just find a font that you like okay this looks good and uh, why I'm going to just uh, write it properly okay and I want to make it two lines go 
need to resize this a little bit and then reduce the line size I don't want such a big gap over here so just line spacing will reduce it a little bit okay as you can see this font is very thin compared to the previous one I used so I'm going to show you that it works uh, both ways so I'm just going to change the title of this and then we are going to do the same thing we are going to download this file and re-upload it back into Canva and then get rid of the background that's what we are going to do okay going to download we need it to be a solid background so we are not going to check on the transparency and it's downloaded now go to upload upload media and then we are going to choose the file that we just downloaded and then we are going to click on it then we are going to get rid of the image background okay go to background removal and here it is click on apply and then you have your very own text that is filled with a gradient so try around and uh, see what you can do and if you'd like to share with me I'd be very very happy to have a look uh, just uh, want to show you this in a black background oh, okay just going to detach this image from the background so that it is just a file okay now I'm going to change the background to a black color and you can see how the gradient is vibing through it so you can actually uh, play around with it and uh, come up with your own Play around with the fonts, play around with the gradients, you can uh, change the gradient up down, you can change the, some of the gradient files, they allow you to change the colors of it, so you can play around with the colors and so on. So if you have any questions, you can leave in the comments box below. I try to read them and reply to them as much as possible. And uh, I've noticed that a lot of people have not subscribed to the channel who are watching, so uh, I request you to kindly subscribe to my channel so that I can grow and uh, it will also keeps me motivated to bring out more videos or if you believe that if, if this video could help someone out please do share this video with them if you like this video please like share and subscribe thank you so much for watching bye bye